what's up guys so I'm just gonna show you how to do a simple spammer uh, spam bot so we'll use two modules first off um, pyata gy okay. oops then search this as a spam file so we'll just call it spam bot dot pi and you will need two modules uh, uh, we're gonna install it with, uh, with pip so you're gonna open PowerShell and uh, type pip install and then pi auto gy. I already have it, so it won't really do anything. So yeah, after we imported that, we need sleep. So sleep function. Okay. After that, uh, we'll just make. Uh, so we'll we'll use the pi auto gy because it has a simple function called pi auto gy dot write and it can write stuff into programs or just send keys so now we'll make a function that counts uh, some time because we will need some time to get into the right window and yeah so we'll just make a function and we'll make a variable and define it to zero make the function like uh, no, we won't make a function so while time does not equal does not equal ten. We'll just um, add one to the variable, and then we're gonna um, add something like sp uh, spam waiting, and then in a string format we'll output the time variable. So if we do this. Uh, we need to do a sleep one between them because Python does it really fast. So you can see if we start this one, two, three, four, five. Easy. So now we can actually um, make the spam bot. So it will take two arguments, message and max message. You can call it however you want. And we'll make another variable. We'll call it count and define it to zero. And while uh, count does not equal max message, um, we'll add one to count. Oh my god! Uh, add one to count. And we'll make a message that sends uh, um, which message we are sending. So send message and then plus counts and a string type count um, so now we, um, what this is gonna do is it's gonna um, use two arguments message and max message the max me message argument is the argument um, which we can tell how many messages we want to send and the message argument is a string type so we can just tell how many um by what type of message we want to send so now we're gonna use the powder gy um, function and powder gy but right and it's gonna write the message argument and it's also gonna so we have to send the message to the user of course so we're gonna have to use the function press and then we'll enter the name of the key and it will be enter and this will automatically send messages we can make a simple bypass so we can make an if statement if the count equals five or uh, the count equals Five uh, multiplied by two, or uh, count equals uh, five multiplied by three, etc. Uh, so this can have uh, fifty messages max because after that there's not an if statement for that. So if the count equals five, ten, or fifteen, we'll sleep for eight seconds to bypass the Discord spam. Uh, the Discord spam is still gonna activate, um, I think, 
but this will be no problem. So, if we call the function and say something like LMA, I don't know, and send 10 messages, um, well, the spam will wait, and we'll just open Discord and wait. Okay, you can actually see that. And uh, you can see five messages, it will wait eight seconds and it will send another uh, five messages and it will repeat 